Hi friends, in this video, we will see how to set stream parameters for IP cameras in Satatya devices. Stream parameters for IP cameras in Satatya devices are Video encoding Resolution Frame rate or frames per second Bit rate GOP or group of pictures Let us see all of them Video encoding Video compression or encoding will reduce the size of the video stream without affecting the quality of the view to the user. H.264 is a widely used video compression technique in the world. A codec based on the H.264 standard compresses a digital video file which uses half the space of MPEG2 that is the DVD standard with the same quality video. We recommend the video encoding procedure as H.264 for better results. Resolution Resolution is the number of pixels, individual point of color, on the horizontal axis and on the vertical axis on a display monitor. The sharpness of the image on display depends on the resolution and the size of the monitor. We recommend keeping the resolution of any IP camera as 1920 cross 1080 at maximum. Frame rate Frame rate or frames per second FPS is the number of frames captured per second to create a video. Each frame is a still image and displaying frames in quick succession creates the video. The more frames per second, the smoother the motion appears. We recommend keeping FPS as 20 or 25 FPS. Bitrate types Bitrate is the rate at which data bits are transferred from camera to the recorder. There are two types of bitrate. One, CBR or constant bitrate. Constant bitrate keeps the data transfer rate as constant. For instance, if the bitrate is set as CBR at 2 Mbps megabits per second, the camera will continue to stream the video at 2 Mbps. Advantage of using CBR is that the quality of video remains the same throughout. We recommend using CBR with bitrate as 2 Mbps that is 2048 kbps. Second, VBR or variable bitrate. In variable bitrate, the data transfer rate varies to save the bandwidth. For instance, if the bitrate type is set as VBR, the camera will stream the video in the lower bitrate when there is less or no motion, otherwise it will stream in higher bitrate. Advantage of using VBR is that the overall size of the video file reduces. We recommend using this type of bitrate when motion in the field of view of a camera is not constant throughout the day. GOP or group of pictures The GOP is a collection of successive pictures within a coded video stream. We recommend keeping GOP as 60 for a smooth playback experience. Now let us start with the configuration. We will complete the configuration in three steps. Set mainstream, set substream, add the camera. Let us start with the first step. Open IP cameras web page in the browser. Go to Configuration, go to Advanced Configuration followed by Video Audio.
Select the stream type. There are two options available. Mainstream of an IP camera is its primary stream with high resolution. Substream of an IP camera is its secondary stream with lower resolution. We will select mainstream normal in this field. Select the video type. There are two options available. Video stream will include only video without audio. Video and audio will include video with audio. Note, for video and audio option, the IP camera must have inbuilt microphone. Select the resolution. Select the bitrate type. We will select constant in this case. Select the frame rate as 25. Select max bitrate as 2048 kbps. Select video encoding method as H.264. Select profile as main profile for mainstream. Enter iframe interval as 60. This is same as GOP explained earlier. This completes the first step. Let us move to the second step for setting substream parameters. Select the stream type as substream. Select the resolution as 704 cross 576. Note, we are keeping resolution of substream lower than that of the mainstream. Select the parameters for bitrate, frame rate, encoding, iframe interval as per the requirement. This completes the second step. Let us move to the third step for adding the IP camera. Open Satatya device client, enter the credentials and login. Go to device configuration. Go to camera settings followed by camera search. Click search. The device will automatically search the IP cameras connected in its network. Stop the search and select the IP camera to be added. Enter the username and password. Default username and password is admin and save it. Go to stream option followed by IP.
The stream parameters configured earlier can be seen in this page. This completes the entire configuration. Thank you for watching this video. For further queries, please contact Matrix Technical Support Team.